OBS Studio is a great screen recorder, but it doesn't include a cursor highlighter. There are some third-party applications available that can be used to highlight the cursor in Windows, and I did a video about one not long ago. I'll put a link for it in the description below. Now I found a, another free cursor highlighter that can be used with OBS Studio or any other screen recorder. The app is called Mouse Pointer Highlight by Catnip5. Let's take a look at Mouse Pointer Highlight. Hi, Dennis Ray here. Everybody's scared of something. Heists, spiders, or milk. Me? I'm scared of running out of ideas for YouTube videos. Gives me the shivers, the heebie-jeebies just thinking about it. Yeah. Please like and comment below, subscribe, and hit the bell to be notified of new videos. Thank you. Mouse Pointer Highlight by Catnip5 is a free app you can get from the Microsoft Store if you have a Microsoft account, and you should if you have Windows 10. I found Mouse Pointer Highlight a couple months ago and really didn't do much with it. Then I ran across a video on YouTube by Halfinity about mouse pointer highlight. I'll put a link in the description below. His video got me more excited about the app so I messed around with the settings, got it set up just the way I like it, and now I'm very impressed with it. I think you will be too. This is the Microsoft Store website where you can get the app and I'll put a link for this in the description below. The name, uh, some information below, some screenshots, some more information, and then to get the app you just hit this bar and it'll go ahead and install itself and you're free to use it. Or another method of getting it is to go to your toolbar, hit the icon for the Microsoft Store, search, you can just type in the name. There it is. And yeah, we'll find it for you. And the same thing. Some information below. And I already have it, so uh, otherwise if this would say Git. And the same thing would just install itself. When you open up Mouse Highlight, this is what it will look like. And to use it, you just minimize it and your highlight will be on the screen. Uh, these are the default settings. Um, and you can change these as you want them. Uh, if you want the size to be different, you can change it to, uh, say, I want 25. Okay. So the highlight is just a little smaller. Say I want the opaque to be uh, a little less opaque. So I change it to 200. Okay, and you can change the color. Mm, say I want yellow, but I want it to be a little brighter. So I'll select the brighter yellow. There. And here for the click highlight, you can turn it off, you can turn it on. And the same thing, you can change the size. Uh, see if I wanted a little smaller, I can do that. You can change the opaque just like the highlight itself. The display time, well, this will make a big difference because right now the time is very slow and then uh, the click sometimes stays in place. So I change that to 200 so it's a lot faster and it doesn't stay in place so easy. Okay, let's apply settings. There. Nice. And you can make changes as you see fit and uh, 
it works very well. Earlier in the intro, I mentioned OBS Studio. This is how mouse pointer highlight works with it, and it works really well. Also, it works good with other screen recorders too. Uh, up to this point, I used a PowerSoft online screen recorder and uh, another commercial app, and mouse pointer did a nice job with them. But I do have one tiny concern. Uh, mouse pointer highlight will hide behind menu at times, as you can see, but the click action will still show up in the front. But it's not a deal breaker. Well, one more thing to show you. I like cats, so uh, when you hit about, you'll get this. Yeah, that's rather cool. That was Mouse Pointer Highlight, a really nice cursor highlight app. Thank you for watching. Be sure to like and comment below. Subscribe and hit the bell to be notified of new videos. If you click my name below, you'll see other videos I've done that may be of interest to you. See you.